Hey YouTube, Roy Marco with Marco Custom Models here. Just doing a quick little update on uh, the uh, Monte Carlo, Nas Carlo, known from Roadkill build that I'm doing. Um, just a couple of things was uh, on the last video, I had the wrong air cleaner on it. Uh, now I got the correct air cleaner on the engine. And the, um, the hole and everything's lined up. Looks pretty good. Then the other thing is the uh, wheels I got from Mike's Deckles. And I don't know if you can see the detail on there. Those are the front wheels. They're wide five bolt pattern racing wheels. And when I ordered the wheels, um, I also ordered a set of tires that uh, came with those wheels. Uh, you order the tires separate. And I thought these tires would be great because they're the correct, uh, they're all well, smooth. They come with Hoosier decals that you would apply to the sidewall that would make it look like in the uh, episode where they first built the car so I um, decided uh, to uh, these were that these tires were too big if you take a look at um, the tires I want to use they're quite a bit wider and they're a little bigger in diameter so because the car is 25th these are probably a 24th wheel but the tire but uh, also on the race cars they're pretty big too so Anyway, uh, they wouldn't fit in the wheel wells correctly and they kind of stuck out too far and everything. It just didn't look right. So right now I have these Goodyear's on here that are just NASCAR tires. They're smooth. Um, but they say Goodyear on the side. On the inside of these tires are smooth so I could have applied the decals. But I wanted the, the, the tire with the uh, rough surface on them, like the tread pattern. So they're dirt tire. Um, these tires here actually have uh, Goodyear raised lettering on both sides of the wheel on the tire I mean so um, if you can see that so I have to sand this off so that's what I did over here this is a tire that's finished what I had done is I had sanded off the uh, Goodyear on both sides and I've done that by putting this on a lathe and sanding this and it took me about 35 minutes a tire so I got two of them done and then I applied the Hooser decals for you to see. I haven't popped them on the wheels yet. I want to paint the wheels and everything first and then pop them on so I'm not taking them on and off. I don't want to risk um, damaging the decals. So I got two wheels done and I have uh, two more to do. And then that'll get on the car, get some paint on the car. I might put a couple little uh, dents yet. I know there's a uh, couple of holes I have to add here for the tail light, like where the corner markers used to be. But I'm not going to get much more fussy than that. I'm just going to start painting this and get it done. Because, um, yeah, otherwise it'll drive you crazy going trying to get every little detail. So let's just get one down here. Um, yeah, so that's it. So um, if you like, please subscribe and uh, have a great day. I hope you enjoy the video. And we'll keep on filming.